Today, I'm gonna use all of these spider toilets against the new endless mode. I figured since not everybody has access to the spider TV, they'd like to see how the spiders compare. Make sure you like and subscribe to only pass Mr. Beast. Uh Okay, guys, so don't hate me. I know I did this last time, but you guys didn't really seem to care. I am once again placing down the Santa TV man early because this would be impossible if I didn't. Come on, you guys know that. Once upon a time, we played this game before and we did try the spider TV by itself. However, I will say the spider TV by itself wasn't that good against endless mode. However, now with the camera spider and spider speaker, maybe our chances of survival have increased. Realistically, our goal with these spider toilets is to make it to wave 75. We're gonna place the speaker spider right here, start level them up, and once our speaker spider is leveled up a bit, we'll go ahead and move to the camera spider, and then we'll go to the spider TV. Surprisingly enough, the speaker spider is actually doing very solid against endless mode. I might have spoke too soon. He's already leaking. Bro, why does his little legs twitch like that when he moves? Why is it doing that? Why is it why is it doing why is it doing that? Is bro acoustic? Also, I will say 50. $1,500 to upgrade the speaker spider right now seems a little too steep for me. I think I'm better off placing the camera spider down. The main difference between the speaker spider and the camera spider would definitely be that the speaker spider does AoE damage while the camera spider only attacks one unit at a time. So in their own rights, when you have them separated, they're not too great. However, when you put the two together, they end up being a very strong ragtag team of spider flying boys. All right, camera spider, do what you can. I mean, it's, it's definitely going down. It, it, it's going down, but it's going really slow. London Bridge is falling down. Hopeless, what is wrong with you, dude? We are gonna upgrade our speaker spider though one more time, as I do think upgrading AoE right now is going to be a smart and beneficial idea. Guys, I'm gonna keep it a buck. I seriously think I need to get a restraining order against my guy, Sammy. He's always looking at me funny, dude. He's looking at me sideways, bro. All right, as the waves continue to kind of intensify, we are going to place down a first spider TV. Its upgrades are literally night and day compared to the camera spider and speaker spider. <coughs> Look at how much bigger it is. What a cute little trio. It's like a father, daughter, and son. Father, daughter. Yeah, that, that sounds right. That makes sense. Huh? The spider TV is so much better than the camera spider and speaker spider. But I guess it makes sense considering it's literally like the rarest unit in the game. I'm going to go on a whim here and say if we didn't place down that camera spider when we did, we might not be alive right now. <gasps> we went ahead and max out our camera spider right before the Mune Toilet 2.0 came out. This will have our boy doing right around 10,000 damage per second, which is in fact enough to hopefully take mm -hmm. on the immune toilet. Yes, it was enough. Okay, the immune toilet died. Fantastic. Also, since this is also, you know, the speaker spider's fly speed, even compared to the spider TV and camera spider is insane. You know, that's something that these units don't say is their walking speed, but man, the camera spider moves pretty fast. The spider TV moves faster, but the speaker spider is the slowest moving, like movable unit I've ever seen seen ever like watch the spider tv goes off he's like got a blast and the speaker spider's like nah bro i'm chilling yeah look at him look at him go he's so slow he's so slow as you can see we have maxed out all of the spider toilets the speaker spider does a max dps of 2400 4000 4000 no 2000 2000 damage per second however the appeal of the speaker spider is our camera spider does a max amount of damage of 9000 per second however it does not do aoe it does centralized damage and like Last and certainly not least, we do the Spider TV that does do 10,000 damage per second, but it is good because it does area of effect damage. Uh-oh, we got the flying dual buzzsaw to it coming down. He is kind of scaring me how fast he's going and how little damage we're doing to him. Come on, speaker. Come on. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. Yeah, I wasn't worried for a second we weren't going to kill there. <clears throat> you know, wave 32 has a lot more bigger health units than I ever realized. Hey, can you guys kill that buzzsaw, please? Hey, can you guys kill the dual rocket launcher toilet, please? Uh, that was close. Hey, you guys kill those giant blind toilets. <laughs> All right, so we're now on wave 35. We've just kind of been kicking back, relaxing, chilling all cool, watching some people. Oh, I'm kidding. We're just watching the Spider TV. It's kind of handle everything at the moment. We turned off auto skip to take things just a little bit slower, mainly because some of these toilets have a lot of health. Also, I'm not liking these welders. They're making me a little bit nervous. Uh, uh, spiders, spiders, please, please come help. 
Please come help. Kill the welder. Oh, no. No way. This isn't happening. There's no way this is happening. It happened. It, ha it happened. Wow. So, clearly, the spiders aren't too good against endless mode on their own. But the better question is, can the spider solo nightmare mode? Uh, bad. Sometimes I do genuinely feel as though endless mode isn't a true test of a unit's strength. So, we are going to try our spiders against nightmare mode to see how they hold up against a true test of strength. We went ahead and started off with the speaker spider once again, and we could not have placed them in a more inefficient spot. Obviously, with nightmare mode and the spider TV units as well, something that I have poked the bear about that makes them so good is that they cannot get stunned. Since the spiders can't get stunned, they can just hover on units and do a buttload of damage without having to worry about getting absolutely... So I went ahead and placed down the spider TV to hopefully take out the mutant toilet, but I don't know if it's gonna be able to. It's making me a little bit nervous. That mutant's barely gonna kick the bucket. So to help out with the boss toilet a little bit, we're also gonna upgrade our camera spider here as well. It also doesn't look good considering we have the mutant toilets and more boss toilets coming. Oh no. We're gonna leak a jetpack toilet. It doesn't kill us. That didn't kill us, but that was really close. And the camera spider decides that it doesn't care about this flying buzzsaw toilet. And the buzzsaw is gonna, um, <coughs> uh... So to be honest with you, hello? So to be honest with you, I don't know exactly how to make up of the spider unit. I know that they're good, but after the eye test and what we just put them through, they don't really seem to be that good. Good. At least not the speaker spider. That one, you should stay away from that one. Either way, without further ado, if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you guys press the like and subscribe button. We are trying to hit 100,000 subscribers and pass Mr. Beast by the end of the year. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys watch yesterday's video. And I will see you guys again tomorrow. Uh, bye! Bro, I can't make this stuff up. I'm literally recording to take pictures and screenshots for my thumbnail. And bro, we get an evil wave. Is the spider TV strong enough to kill an evil wave though? Come on, come on, let's skip, 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 skip. That's so funny. Out of nowhere, we just got an evil wave. <laughs> that is amazing. A little Easter egg at the end of the video. How about that? Oh, it's hopeless. Oh, it's... Hopeless trying to get partner in TTD, but they don't wanna give it to me. I spent all my money on units and Robux. You know, I want the best units. I'm gonna put in the work, I'ma put it in the paint. You know what I'm saying, player. Then I go around, find the best units, put them to the test, show them who's best. Flexing on the boys that don't got my best. Gonna sign units once upon a time. I know that I will never rest. Until that day happens. Thank you for watching. I love you.